lockdown was lifted and we set out on one of our biggest challenges to date. A single day, sun up to sundown, 450 kilometer ride in support of SVG50, an ultra rare neurodegenerative disease. This is Capital to Capital. The idea at the beginning was very daunting. I actually at one point decided I wasn't going to do it. 450 kilometers door to door, certainly bigger than anything um, any of us had done before. And just go on that journey together. We decided to challenge ourselves for a very long ride from capital to capital. I was talking with my friend here in the community and his son Michael is battling this neurodegenerative disorder. He's three years old and it is slowly crippling him. Terry had this idea for a fundraiser to ride from Toronto to Ottawa. And when we heard about that, you know, we wanted to help out. We wanted to raise awareness. Terry, who's new to the sport and cycling, you know, completed that on his own. But he actually made it to Ottawa and, and was able to sit down with, with our Prime Minister and have a conversation about some of the gaps in, in the healthcare programs. It was an opportunity to come together as a family, as a team, for one big epic experience. As a team, we just came together really well and we made the most out of it for sure. There was like that really sketchy bridge crossing which I didn't actually think we were going to do but like Anton just like put that bike on his shoulder and started climbing up that ladder so I guess we ended up crossing that sketchy bridge. And that was like kind of a highlight of the whole ride. Very difficult, um, but it was great to come together and we just worked so well, we bonded really well. It was a great, amazing event. It was a beautiful time of the season um, and just to do such a long distance and spend that much time with your teammates and friends was uh, quite rewarding. It was a season that was lost and then found. 2020 challenged all of us, mentally, physically and emotionally, but we each came away knowing that there is more to the cycling community than racing. We are here to empower, build and use our voices to make change and do good. As we look ahead to 2021, we hope to line up as a squad again, but won't stop working for positive change on our streets and in our neighbourhoods. <laughs>